guys, I hope you're already well. So today I'm going to be doing a clothing haul. These things are from Pull and Bear, um, Free People, and then I've got a few little things from And Other Stories. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video, and I'm just going to get straight on and show you guys what I got. Oh, I think there is also a little thing from Urban Outfitters. So yeah, let's get on with the video. So let's start with Pull and Bear. I got quite a lot from Pull and Bear. <laughs> I'm going to start with the first thing that I am completely in love with and that I've already worn to a friend's little barbecue I went to the other day and it's a little co set so the top looks like this, it's just super pretty, a little like rusty pink colour um, with lots of little ditzy florals all over it, really really pretty and it's got shearing around the middle so it's super supportive, you don't need to wear a bra with this. You still could probably get away with wearing a bra with this because I wear it with the like bits up, you could wear it with it down like this, um, but I don't feel the need to wear a bra with this, so yeah, that is the top part. And then the skirt, I actually sized up to a medium because normally I'm a small, um, and I should have got a small, but I was just too excited to wear it so I didn't bother sending it back, so I've just safety pinned the back. But basically pull and bear can often be like um, quite tight on me, like some of their sizings, so I went up instead of being sad about it not fitting. <laughs> but this is what the skirt looks like. It just buttons down the middle and then there's some little slits at the edges for your legs to pop out. <laughs> but yeah, it's just such a lovely little co -ord. It's really, really comfy to wear. I was um, very comfy the whole time I was at the barbecues. So yeah, really recommend this. Such a nice little... Um, summer piece but also like the colours are very autumn-y so you could definitely just chuck a jacket on with this and it would be a great little autumn autumn piece. I then picked up a pair of flared legging trousery sort of things. I bought these in a size small and they fit perfectly and they're like a really really small rib um, but they are so flattering and really long so like they go over your um, trainers which I really like because lots of the like flared leggings are just not long enough and these ones are actually really long which is perfect it's just what you want with some flares um so yeah very very flattering pair of leggings and I'm super happy I found these because the only other pair of flared black leggings I have are like velvet from Topshop and they're so hot to wear that I haven't been able to wear anything in the summer that's like black and flared so I can finally wear something now. I love Pull and Bear t-shirts, they're always in such a nice soft cotton so I picked up another one. This is just one of the band style t-shirts. I got it in a medium so it's a tiny bit oversized but yeah, really like this. This would go really well with the black flares I just showed so yeah, nice and easy. Love a good t-shirt. Then if you guys follow me on Instagram you'll have probably seen a while ago I posted a photo of like a matching blue suit um, which was also from Pull and Bear and the suit trousers are so comfortable but I wasn't finding that I would wear the blue much so I found them in the grey. They actually come in loads of different colours. Um, I got it in a size small and they're just the perfect pair of trousers really, like smart looking trousers. They're like a really nice lightweight feel, they don't crease too bad and just really easy. This sort of grey I can't wear too close to my face because it just washes me out completely but in the trouser area it's fine. <laughs> and then finally from Pull and Bear I picked up two pairs of sunglasses. Um, one of them I think I'm going to send back. Um, these ones I think I'm going to send back. They're like, um, they look like this, but they're just way too tight on my head, so I'm going to send these ones back. They all come in these really gorgeous neoprene um, little sunglass cases. And then the next ones I got are a little bit funky. I don't have any of these like yellow ones. I had some ages ago, but they didn't fit my face or like, they just literally fell off as soon as I tilted my head. So. I didn't keep those, but these are really inexpensive and I just thought I'd give them a go. I don't know if they look really stupid or not. <laughs> look cool in like a photo shoot or something maybe. Who knows. They have 100% UV protection though, so that's very good. Oh, I forgot I also got some little tortoiseshell hoop earrings 
which are very on trend at the moment. The whole cult gay, uh, is that how you say the brand? I think so. <laughs> I'm not sure, it's a really weird spelling of the brand, but they're like known for their tortoise shell earrings and like those um, wooden bags that people carry. So yeah, excited to wear these. Oh, hidden in all of that is a random purchase I got on eBay the other day, um, which is this little beaded bag. I just thought this was so sweet. Um, I really wanted like a shrimp's beaded bag, but they're so expensive. Um, so I'm just like constantly looking for little vintage finds that are like beaded. This one isn't very vintage, it's just M&S, <laughs> um, but like old M&S, I think doesn't actually say when it was from but who knows might even be current MS for all I know <laughs> so yeah a very sweet little eBay find there then the one thing I have to show you guys from Urban Outfitters is an underwear set that I have a current obsession with to be quite honest so obsessed that I have it in three different colorways now <laughs> but this is the most recent one I picked up and it is in like a little pink shade this is such a nice sort of like raspberry pink and they are just in the softest fabric ever it literally feels like you're not wearing anything on your skin and then they have matching pants that look like this so super cute quite like high cut on your legs um so they're really flattering um the pants are six pounds and the tops are £12 and then I also get a student discount on top of these so yeah if you guys are looking for new underwear sets this is where you need to go Urban Outfitters and also I do have to get a size large in the tops though because around my ribs I'm a 34 so these sorts of tops can be really tight on me and I get really weird anxiety if something's too tight on my ribs I'm like I can't breathe <laughs> so yeah I have to get size large. But then I just get small in the pants, so just in case you're wondering about sizing for these. Okay, moving on to stuff from Free People, my favourite place. I'm going to start out with something I have had so many compliments on. Um, I wore this to work and literally everyone asked me where this was from or like that they liked my outfit that day. So clearly it looks good. <laughs> um, so this is a little top, it's just in this really nice neutral colour and the fabric is so gorgeous, it's so soft and it's like slightly striped in texture and it's just, <laughs> it's so nice and then the sleeves they just go in at the end and they're nice and big and then it comes in a little set with this little skirt which is so sweet and it's honestly the comfiest thing to wear on like a reasonably warm day um, when it's not too windy <laughs> otherwise this skirt likes to blow up um, yeah it's just so gorgeous like I'm so happy with this set I know it's gonna be in my wardrobe for a long time because every time I put it on I'm just like oh, I feel amazing I feel so comfy and yet cool and people are liking my outfit the same applies for this dress as well this is such an interesting color it's just a very bright coral which I don't really wear that much anymore because I find it a bit tricky to style um, so it does come with a slip underneath which is really helpful and you can attach the slip to the top I don't like doing that because I find that they twist and do funny things um, so this is what the dress looks like it's like a broidery anglaise sort of style fabric um, with massive sleeves um, and then it's like tight on the body um, and then it's just got little cuffs the cuffs could be a bit smaller that's like the only thing that annoys me about this dress but apart from that I love it super pretty and I get loads of compliments on it again. Very special dress and I'm very happy I picked this up. And then finally from Free People, my favourite jumper at the moment. It is this little wrap style with like really wide sleeves. Um, it's just, it's in like the softest fabric, it's acrylic but it's so so soft. Um, it just wraps around, super flattering and the colour just goes so nicely with my hair colour, I really really like this, it's just really nude, slightly pink colour and yeah it looks great with flared jeans, I really love that look. It's been in my like wish list in Free People for ages and then I just decided to get it and I love it so much, 
Then finally, I have a few little things from And Other Stories. And some of them are starting to get into the autumn feel of things, which I'm so excited about. But the first one is a little check set. I'm really loving sets at the moment. I just think they make you look so put together and so pretty. So the first part of the set are these little check shorts, which is super, super cute. Um, I think these might be in the sale at the moment. I'm not sure. But anyway, they just look like this. And then like a nice silky sort of feeling fabric. So they're just like a viscose fabric, which is like the acrylic version of silk, which is much better, much more ethical. <laughs> so yeah, super cute little shorts. And then the top part is this amazing like organza um, shirt. I think this might be silk. So this is mainly polyester and there's a tiny bit of silk in it. Um, but it just looks like this and it's just so interesting it's like slightly see-through and I saw this in the shop um, as a set and I was just like drawn to it I was like I need that as a set and I think it's so cute it looks so good with like your hair in like a high bun or like a low messy bun like I've got it today except I've got it in a ponytail I then have a little black bra from them um, it's just in a little I haven't actually tried this on yet I need to check it fits okay but um, yeah, it's just really cute and lacy. The lacy detailing comes up a little bit. I, I don't really buy that many padded bras anymore just because I don't wear padded bras that often, but it's nice to have some nice little special bras every now and then. And also bra shopping is like my favorite thing to do. So if you guys ever want me to do like a bra haul or like underwear haul, probably not try on, <laughs> um, then let me know because that is actually something that I would probably really like to do. And then the final thing I have is this gorgeous, gorgeous camel wool oversized blazer and I am so excited to start wearing this, you have no idea. I have wanted a coat like this for so long and it's just so perfect, it's like oversized and camel and gorgeous and and other story coats are just made so beautifully like, like there's so many gorgeous details in this coat like the little under collar and then this folds over here and you have a little button and you can cross it over and it's just it's just so well thought out and it's so nice to have pieces like this that you just know are such good quality and have been made really well so yeah really really gorgeous piece so excited to wear this in autumn and winter and I just think it's such a good little investment piece if you're looking for a coat this season this could be the one <laughs> so that is the end of this video I really hope you guys have enjoyed it let me know in the comments down below as always which one was your favorite piece I think mine probably has to be the camel coat or the little pull and bear set at the start I've been wearing that like non-stop at the moment so yeah let me know in the comments down below I hope you guys are all having a great day and I will see you all in my next video bye